Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel Scorpio. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good Scorpio. This reading for today, it is a love reading. This is a love reading. This is a love message for the Scorpio sign. Thank you so much Scorpio for supporting the channel. Thank you so much Scorpio for being here. Let's look into love and relationship and dating and getting to know. Let's look into what's coming towards you. What is the message that you need to hear right now when it comes to a romantic energy? Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Let's look into love. What is love? What is your love message? Scorpio, you're here now. Thank you. Oh, Scorpio, please don't forget to click the like, the subscribe. Thank you for your support. Ooh, nice wow scorpio wow scorpio this is definitely a love reading and a ten of cups wow scorpio what can i get for the scorpio sign it's coming from a king of pentacles the eight of swords someone is lost scorpio yeah eight of cups okay let me just pull all the cards Wow, Scorpio, this is a soulmate. You know what? There's a new moon today. Today is the new moon in Leo. And it's also Mercury retrograde. It's like backtrack and then wild card. So the universe is going to backtrack and send you wild card. Send you the best missed opportunity. You know that, uh, what's that? I'm um, sorry guys, I'm just going to hold my microphone so you can hear me properly. Have you watched those? I think it's, um, you know that singing thing? I forgot, you like, oh, um, the one that's the got talent thing. You know what? You know when they eliminate it and then they will send back the best of the best. So this is your romantic. This is the Mercury retrograde. This is how I feel intuitively about the mercury retrograde happening um alongside with the new moon in leo it's like okay let's bring let's bring back the sexy <laughs> sexy back yeah <laughs> scorpio okay all right let's get serious about your reading well first of all you have an offer it could be a capricorn a taurus a virgo energy um you have an offer, okay? Um, so the Ace of Pentacles is coming from a certified lover or soulmate, okay? You know, this soulmate or lover is someone you've confessed to them that you like them or they probably have confessed to you that they like you. If not, if it's not that case, you have a lot of chemistry, like this is you lost this lover or romantic energy for all of the wrong reason. It's like the perfect person, but you've lost them for all of the wrong reason. It's like a biggest heartache or heartbreak because you lost them because not that you don't like them. In fact, you really like them. And so they are to you. You had a breakup because of something unpredictable, something something that probably it was meant for you and this person to kind of break up so they can work on their shadow in you too but it was it's a feeling of you're on top of the world scorpio you know that song i'm on the top of the world living down on creation and the there's there's a sometimes i would hear music because i need to pick up a line that's the feeling that you have with this person like it's it's nostalgic it's very familiar it's very safe and there's so much chemistry like you you have you have a lot of sense of familiarity with them it is as if your soul have been together you know like it's top of the world you holding hands like you're so used to their smell to their smile like you know them even though for a short period of time like like there's a growing like they grow on you you know this soulmate card in here the ten of cups i mean look at that so you were like they put you on top of the world thank you spirit like you know that song 
Yeah, on top of the world, living down on creation, and the only explanation I can find, it's the love that I found, and it's simply being around. Your love put me at the top of the world. It's like that. It's like high school and sweetheart, and there's so much charm between the two of you. They make you giggle. I also pick up with the Ace of Pentacles in here that although you guys are like little kids and you know like high school sweet high school sweetheart you know like so much chemistry you see a future in them this is not just a soulmate for charming no this is not just prince charming you know there it's like it's not just a prince charming it's also like a very practical union like something is really going to work out in terms of your stability in terms of your in terms of security you can really depend on them you know like there's something security dependability they've sort out like this is a person who you met them where they've sort out their finances because sometimes security finance and stability it it is a factor for long-term partnership marriage and kids like so this person they can offer you that they can offer you both the highs and the highs you know because this is an ace of pentacles and the lover's card you met them when you were so ready to do everything in a commitment and so they are but you've lost them for some technicality like i'm not like I'm really picking up a psychic feel like I'm I'm picking up a psychic feeling to not discuss about the past like I'm being drawn by my intuition to don't discuss the, don't discuss the past because the past is gone this is probably a soulmate with a new brand new offer with the ace of pentacles in here okay um this is they have a letter l maybe this is an x the one that got away um there was something beautiful in their smile like they have a mole they have a smile like their eyebrow and their eyes is so beautiful like there's something so beautiful with their eyes and eyebrow uh they, they have a special unique feature that you really really like or like their their beauty or handsomeness it it grows on you scorpio like you see depth in their eyes scorpio this is very very soulful now they will be back scorpio this person who puts you on top of the world scorpio they're gonna be back a soulmate will return this is a wild card scorpio i think you went you you will never forget the date there was an unforgettable date that you went through together there was something this unforgettable conversation or date okay so this is like you know a wild card with the new moon and leo do it, i think it's today it's happening now so with the new moon leo influence and the mercury is active mercury retrograde active like mercury retrograde activated in the new moon and leo it's like let's bring back the sexy soulmate the best of the best missed opportunity okay so this lover um they're very sad you will start with like a sad like if, if this was a if this was if the way this person is gonna connect with you scorpio it's like sad sad movie okay like they're going the king of pentacles because i want to offer you i'm a soulmate okay this person like i'm your soulmate i have experienced one of the best you you've shared I mean, the, the lover's card, the Ten of Cups, is like shared happy memories. Like the way I've discarded, like my introduction, it's that's basically the Ten of Cups in here. Now, I'm offering you my Ace of Pentacles, and I am a King of Pentacles now, but I'm very sad. Like this person, I have my life sort, like I have, I have my life sorted, but I don't have a muse. I don't have a soulmate. They probably went into maybe dating or getting to know because this King of Pentacles, they have an Eight of Swords. Okay, this is an Eight and an Eight. So this King of Pentacles, who is your soulmate, who has experienced an amazing dating or getting to know or an amazing relationship with you, 
They have the money, stability, the freedom. They're the king of pentacles. They wanted, you know, they really, really wanted to commit now. They have an eight of swords. The eight of swords in here, it represents your competition. It could be the people that you work. Sorry. It could be the people that they date with. It could be the, the you know, the, the, the people that they date with. Or maybe this, this is the person that they chose over you. But the king of pentacles, they have choices. They have many choices, in fact. They went through choices. But they were not happy. Look at that. The Eight of Swords, the Eight of Cups. They have choices. They went to dating, getting to know. They probably replace you with another person. But all they can get is an Eight of Swords, an empty heart. Again, okay, overthinking and an empty heart. This is useless. Like the life the life they had without you um being disconnected with you was all about an eight of swords work work or maybe they have someone but it does not intrigue them it does not challenge them it is not smart enough for them to feel good to feel b they belong scorpio so this is your person. This is the soulmate looking at the eight of swords. They've got, they've, I'm really picking up the vibe. They've got their life sorted. They have someone, but they're very sure, solidly sure, not interested. They're moving away. They're moving on from the complicated thing they did against you. Or they're moving on and giving up from the choice that is, that took them against you or losing you. This is a person who made a choice. They they made a stupid choice. They made a stupid choice, a stupid ego that led them to lose you. They regret that. There's so much stability. Like I, this person, Scorpio, there's so much stability. So much, there's so much commitment that they can give and so much time and stability that now they realize, what will I do, Ace of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, what will I do with this money and stability and freedom and security if I will not have the Ten of Cups? They have this? No, I don't want that. So this person is realizing if there is something missing in their life, it's the Ten of Cups. And that Ten of Cups, it's only experienced once in their life and when they were with you. Okay? Scorpio, the, the eight. Like right now, this person, like, look at that. This is already eight, number eight. Eight, eight. And the sun card is also like number eight. You know, Leo is also eight. Eight, eight, eight. So, ooh, this person is really thinking hard, thinking big, very dramatic. They might send you a big text message, a big email. There's something dramatic entrance with this person. It's like drum roll, drum roll. I am back and lots of passionate explanation and declaration Scorpio I could feel like you're what why are you so dramatic why are you being this but you like it Scorpio they're gonna pledge their love towards you yeah look at you look at that my pledge of love Scorpio hear me hear my heart calling Scorpio this is you what can you just return like a soulmate don't be a poet. <laughs> Don't be a karaoke singer like Sunshine. Can we just make it less dramatic, Mr. Soulmate? Miss Soulmate. This is you. Like, you're quite shocked. You're cerebral. Like, in this reading, Scorpio, you're very cerebral. Or you're very mercurial. You're mercurially. Like, you're excited but practical. Okay, like, okay, you're back. Let's get into the conversation. This person is coming back emotional. And passionate also and the king of pentacles i think you know with it because the eight of cups is making them emotional like okay so this is a bit of a red flag scorpio okay eight of cups not really like a red flag but do not think that this person is coming back because they're sad or lonely i mean they're sad because they've lost you and if they keep moving forward, they will find a soulmate. But right now, they're determined that they've already met the soulmate. If this person keeps moving forward, they will eventually find another soulmate. But they prefer prefer to come back to a soulmate that they weren't able to serve well or properly. Like you are a soul, a missed 
opportunity that's connected to soul okay don't think that this person is coming back sad i don't think so or needy no they're just dramatic explaining to you how sorrowful it is of what they did towards you okay because if you do reject them scorpio they will move on eventually this person can find a soulmate and you might go it might drive you crazy because one of the shadow of this per one of the shadow learnings of this person is that they should have followed their heart okay not their ego okay there was ego a lot with this person in the past or they probably followed something so practical in terms of love and they will never do that again there's some karmic lesson with this person so they're really returning they're just dramatic you know five eight of cups five of cups it's like they're going to explain and express to you how sorrowful they are like they will tell you, you know what i was lost i was this i was that don't get me wrong scorpio they're just expressing how sad they are when they've lost you but it's not sad that they're going to like you know like how do i say this they're not coming from a place of sadness that they're coming back they're coming from a place of a huge realization that you are indeed indeed their lover and they will be sad if they will let you go again okay that's this the five of cups in here okay yeah ace of swords see there's something solid about this person's return although you might misunderstand or misinterpret them because don't think that they don't have a choice they have a choice but they don't want that they're realizing that the only choice in the past was a soulmate like you so they they want to bring justice ace of swords to your relationship or to your connection scorpio okay you might find it a bit you might find them dramatic i'm telling you right now but that's just how they're going to pledge their love and confess their feelings they will pledge their love and they will confess their feelings scorpio and the knight of cups and then you will remember how it feels to be on top of the world with this person i think in this reading i think in this reading you're quite into okay you're back let's get into it like there's something maybe business like there's something about you that maybe you're not yet immersed into your feelings towards them like you know let let me see what you got you're very logical and maybe how do I assert like you're you're assertive to know what do you want why are you dramatic you know you're it, it's coming to you that why are you dramatic you know um we but eventually you will understand their feelings they will be able to convey it in such a way you're assertive thank you spirit like you're assertive you're assertive in here very assertive and passionate to know like, like let's let's not make it dramatic let's make it let's make sense of you returning to me i want to know like i want to know but they come a bit, a bit dramatic so let's ju let's just it's more of let let them pledge their love let them confess let's just let them drive you crazy with their confession it's gonna drive you crazy let them pour out their feelings it's gonna help you understand where they're coming from you're coming with passion and assertive passion and logic and assertiveness this person is coming from passion and emotion so it's a bit it's a bit too much for you but you can process it scorpio just give it give it give them time okay it's because whoever this person is you know the way they're going to present themselves is they don't want to be hey i'm back can i marry you no i don't think so i don't think it's going to be like that you know especially the sun card they want you to trust them they want you to know the history of what happened how sad they are and then eventually declare love the knight of cups okay so there is they have to go through something you know for the declaration of love it has a ceremony you know it like it's like a subject the first paragraph the mid paragraph and the third paragraph so it's not something like they they thought about this so there's a ceremony so just give them time just give them the time they need to declare their intention okay because it's well thought it it's well planned okay it comes with it comes with a ceremony i would say scorpio this is okay all right now this is your reading 
thank you scorpio for supporting the channel thank you guys for being here um i'm gonna put down the link down the description box below i have uploaded a i think i went live i went live to the exclude sorry i yeah sorry this is gonna be a update they uploaded in the exclusive channel i went live in the main i went live into the main channel um i recommend you watch the video so i'll put the link down in the description box below for you scorpio okay thank you so much and um i will see you soon click the bell click subscribe bye bye scorpio